Oh man. Don't start that shit again, Facebook. That shit. Oh, here we go. All right. But hey, we're about to get it. Family, yeah, okay, cool. All right, family, I want to welcome you. This is Gianni Journey. We got a couple of faux pas going on right now, a couple of faux pas that are happening. Brother, our team going to work it out. We're going to work it out because that's what we do when stuff starts going wrong, right? We can't allow it. it slow us down. I got to retype in. All of the information for Facebook, because you know a Facebook family is live on these toasts. And uh, my speaker went down. I don't know what's going on, but yeah, I do know what's going on. I'm not bad. Same for you, YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Give me a second. Jima. Forward slash Kuji Chagalia. Caps, all caps. How do I do that? There you go. Man, I hate when it look like this, man, but it is. No, no, no. Oh, shit. What is going down? I don't give a shit. What's going down? Let's get it. 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 We uh y'all can't stop me. It can't be stopped. This can't be stopped. We won't stop. Get your water, get your water. Come on, family. Come on. Drink your water. Drink, 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 drink. Drink your water. Lift your glass and drink your water. I say, lift your glass and drink your water. Lift your glass and drink your water. Lift your glass and drink your water. Drink, 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 drink. Drink, 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 drink. Lift your glass and toast your ancestors. 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 Drink, 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 drink. Drink, 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 drink. Lift your glass and drink your water. 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 Drink, 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 drink. Drink, 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 drink. Take your breath and drink your water. Take your breath and drink some water. Take your breath and drink some water. Drink some water. Drink, 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 drink. Drink, 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 drink. Move your body, drink some water. 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 Drink, 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 drink. 
Drink, 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 drink. Great Kooji Chagalia. Great Kooji Chagalia. It's Kwanzaa. Great Kooji Chagalia. Great Kooji Chagalia. Drink, 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 drink. Lift your glass and drink some water. Lift some glass and drink some water. Look at that. Lift your glass and drink your water. Lift your glass and drink your water. Drink, 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 drink. Drink, 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 drink. Grab a folk till drink some water. Read a folk till drink some water. Read your folk till drink some water. Read your folk till drink some water. Drink, 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 drink. Ah. Drink, 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 drink. Shout out to Brother Kwame. Babari Ghani to you as well. It's Kooji Chagalia before us. It's Ujima slash Kooji Chagalia. It's the second day of Kwanzaa, family. It's the second day of Kwanzaa. I'm feeling good. Energy is high. I'm ready to get this conversation started. You know, it's important that right now, right now, because we have to understand this, right? Right now is where we celebrate. Right now is where we come together as a family and celebrate. The first candle has been lit, which means that we have gained a day. We have gained one minute of light, right? We gained one minute of light, successfully celebrated one of the principles. Now, all of the principles are important. So it's important that we come together and we make sure we get all seven of them in. Yesterday was a moja. Today is Kooji Chagalia family. Mm. You drink your water, as you see me doing. Get your water in, because we can't toast our ancestors unless we making sure that we take care of ourselves. And we know that it's hard in this world nowadays to take care of yourselves. It's very expensive to be healthy nowadays, right? So make sure that at least when you come together, when we come together to do our toast, we're looking out for us, right? Because by looking out for us, we know we're looking out for future generations, right? So go and drink your water. I'm gonna drink this last little glass. I got another bottle over here, but we'll kill that as the conversation rolls on. Because I think some of y'all are going to get up on this line today. Last night was a marvelous show. And we're going to talk a little bit about that. But, you know, I'm going to save that to um, um, for a little bit later. But, family, let me make sure you understand. We are up on here live this morning. Since I've been blessed with this time off, of course, you know, I'm opening the lines. It should go down because we need to have intelligent conversation about our principles. We need some of y'all that follow the news to let the people on Giami Journey know what's going on out there in the world. And while we on that right now, let's do this. First, I need to let you know that you are now listening to Giami Journey. I got everything low because all the keys to sleep. We want to keep them sleep, right? And of course, you know, this is the Daily Toast and this is the heart of a simple production. Well, we strive, strive, strive paradigms. If I haven't given you pause to think by the end of my shows, I have failed. If I have not, in a sense, challenged you or hit you with a new angle or something, I have failed. Brother Kwame say, what was 
our account last night, trying to make those numbers notable, notable can measure growth, at least quantitatively. Well, let me say this. Every seat in that room was filled, plus the tables in the back. So I'm thinking we might have had at least 150 to 200 people last night. Now we got to keep the numbers up. Now we got to keep it popping. You understand what I'm saying? So, hey, great, because uh, Brother Kwame saying we got to we got to quantify, right? We got to quantify what's going on so the people know. And then you look on Facebook, check some of your friends, right? You got different people streaming. Kwanzaa from Columbus. I had uh, I seen sisters that used to live here. Who who was uh, posting up a celebration all the way in L.A., right? So right after ours was off, you could have joined theirs. You know what I'm saying? I was I was popping in, checking it out. You know what I'm saying? So they had, I mean, you know what I'm saying? Hey, hey. So now we got to really put on the show tonight, family, because now we know there's other families out there that's that's it ain't competing, but we all sharing in the energy of Kwanzaa, right? Mm. Ah, all right. So we're gonna do this toast, and then we're gonna get into the conversation. I need to post up this number. That's what I was trying to do. Let me post up this number. I'll be missing an action tonight in turning an uncle. Oh, brother. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, throw his name up so that we could toast him this morning. Um, four, five, five, six, four, five, three, five. Your energy definitely will be missed, my brother. Your energy definitely will be missed. Number up. So we're going to do the toast. Um, so what what's going on today, brother Hakim? This morning on Kuji Chagalia is Ujima for us. The show will be hosted tonight by the lovely Earth Jalo and Malik Willoughby. That's gonna be a good. That's gonna be a good combination. Shouts out to brother Hazim, man. I hope to see you out at Kwanzaa. And if you would, hey, hit up hit up Ashibu. Y'all come on out. Um. Of course, it starts at six o'clock. Um, we will be giving out the award for um, uh, Tawi Village Planning Collective and Honoree. Um, I don't know who we will be giving out the award to tonight. Activists tonight. We're giving out an award. So come out here and support um, the individual that won it. I don't know. Maybe it's the artist. I It had it on here before. I don't see it. All right. Um, we're going to be joined by the Linda McKinley Choir, the uh, Black National Anthem, as well as a couple, couple of other um, songs. Yeah, it's going to be the arts tonight. Mm-hmm. Uh, Brother Gamal going to be giving away that one. Um, Ohio Black Dance Organization. We're gonna have some. We're gonna have some talent in the house tonight. Performance as well. Brother Isid and the Advanced Party will also be performing. So it's gonna be hot tonight, family. It's gonna be hot. We got Elder Isid, somebody who's been in the community, been active in the community for a long, long time. Um, Brother Kwame's uncle. Um, Perry, Uncle Perry Rogers, Uncle Perry Rogers, Uncle Perry Rogers. May a full wind feel your sails as you travel on. That shit was hot. That's hot, Kwame. I mean, I, I know you're a, math, a mathematician, but I, you know, I guess you, you know, you kind of smooth with them words there. I, you know, that was hot. You know, I'm gonna steal that shit, right? I just want you to know, yeah, that shit gone, right? 
So uh, y'all know. All right, so we had an excellent show last night, right? We had uh, you know, Lady J called in. Lady J is 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 one of those young Jedi, one of those young warriors. Every time she called in, you know it's gonna be hot because she has a strong opinion, right? So she called in last night. I mean, I had to surrender. She get going. You can't, you know what I'm saying? It's like the juggernaut. It's just, you, you, you can't stop it. Going, it, it, she won't stop. On and on and on and on. And it was a great conversation last night. And that's the way I want to, that's the way the show is designed. Of course, I'm going to have a strong opinion. Other people to come on. And I'm not trying to shut you down. What I'm trying to do is to get the thoughts out there. Right, because we are, our news is being attacked, everything is being eliminated, family. And I need y'all to understand, right? Because I'm going to bring up a point that hit me this morning as I was brushing my teeth and saying my pledge. Well, I didn't say my pledge, so let me say my pledge now. I am a Giammy man. I was born for greatness. My greatness comes from my potent center. I pledge to find and connect with my center. I pledge to build. Um, my spirit, mind, and body. I pledge to use my hands to build a world, better world for myself, my loved ones, and my community. I pledge to use my mind. I pledge to use my mind to 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 build for my community. I pledge to live my life and push past all my self-imposed limitations. I pledge to promote the principles of the Giami tribe and assist all those seeking the path of success. I pledge all these things first to myself my teachers, to all my relations, to my ancestors. I'm Giammy, Ashe, Ashe, Ashe. Kind of fucked up. I'm having brain farts this morning. I don't know what's going on. I might need some more water. Or I might need some ambrosia. It's time for us to do the toast. But family, listen, like and share because I'm going to be sharing some information from the story last night, right? That I think is very important that we, because it was, it's a very crucial point about life and death that I have been noticing about a lot of these folk tales. And I want us to really have a discussion because it's going to plug into the principle of Kuji Chaga Lee. Self family, self determination. Right? But we're gonna we're gonna lift up our ancestors at this point in time. I'm still sipping on that now. I'm still sipping on that um, black sea and that um, ocean. And what's crazy about this, right, is the black sea sour, right? I tasted it, and I, the first thing that came to my mouth is, I don't remember putting no lemons in this. He said the same thing. I don't know if Brother Kwame want to make some comments because this ground up black sea did, is doing it different than the um whole because the last time i made it for you brother kwame it was the whole ground but i think the ground is working a little bit better for me you know what i'm saying um because i'm going through this bottle right for those that was on the conversation on the 25th i finally got brother kwame his uh ginseng rope you know what i'm saying so we could shut all rumors down I may got his ginseng root, right? So feel free to like and share. Um, send out to some of your friends. Let me go on and share this while I'm at it too. I'm gonna go on and share it on a couple of my timelines because y'all know how we do this here, right? So um, here is the book from Kwanzaa. Brother Ta Tau did an excellent job, right? I don't want to share. Should I share it on Hootsuite? Hootsuite does. All right. Also tonight during Kwanzaa, not tonight during the day. Kwanzaa activities for Watotos and children, thirty location drive-in park recreation center hosted by Mom, Mama Fadia, Elder Gray, Elder Issa, and Makita Pittman. All right. It's going to be tight. Like I said, this is a celebration. You know what I'm saying? So make sure that y'all come out. I mean, if you have kids, family, we talking about 
family time from 2 to 4.30. So Kwanzaa is not just a celebration from 6 to, from six to 8 or 6 to 9. It goes beyond that. Come on, come on now. Bring your family out. Let's kick it. Right on my time. I need to share on my page, family, so I can make sure I get some of the people from Giame over here. You know what I'm saying? Because some people be watching different different um, things. But while I'm waiting for that to come up, we lift up our class. We lift up our class. Uh, Brother Kwame said, I would agree that the crushed black seed is awesome. And my, okay, cool. That's all I like. That's all I need to know, brother. So we're going to be using until they take it off the market. Damn ginseng. And I don't know about ordering it because it got to stay cold. You know what I'm saying? Stay cold. You know what I'm saying? Maybe we, maybe I might need to order and see if we get the, the, the whole dry root. Listen up on Giami Journey right now. I'm gonna post up on um on uh, folk tales for grown folks because you know for those that don't know we do have a page for folk tales for grown folks as well, right? So I need y'all to understand that I'm not playing with this, right? This is what I'm doing. This, this is what I do every morning. This ain't for us. Kwanzaa is 365, family. For us, Kwanzaa is 365. I just want y'all to know that. I want y'all to know that. I need y'all to know that, right? We come up. We lift up our glass. Grab the glasses. We grown folks. Grab the glasses. You know what I'm saying? Grab the glasses. When you was a child, you did as a child, right? Right now. We adults who come together and we are toasting our ancestors. I'll post up on the 21 Day Goose Sabbath Challenge. We're going to talk about that too. Um, yeah, so when we toast mm -hmm. our creator, right? We toast the source of all things, right? We lift up our glass and we act for that energy to bless and guide us on this second day of Kwanzaa. Right, Kwanzaa. The thing to see the village come together and to see the energy of the creator moving in the room, to see all the network networking going on, to see all of the love being shared, to see old and new relationships energized. Lift up the glass and salute all of us, right? And made that moment possible. Okay, so we lift up the glass. Okay, from there, family, <laughs> we move on. What do we move on to, Brother Hot Tim? We move on mm -hmm. to the most beautiful part. We move on to our personal ancestors, right? We lift up our glass and we salute those that made it possible for us to exist at this point in time. And I know that's going to offend some of y'all, but I don't give a D-A-M-N. You know why? Because if not for my grandmother's prayers, family, I wouldn't have made it this far. If not for my grandfather's words and sternness, I wouldn't have made it this far. If not for my other grandma sitting me down and showing me love. If not for my aunt allowing me to come over and spend time with her kids, right? You know what I'm saying? My aunties that passed away. If not for my uncle being able to step up for me, right? I would not be here, family. Stories that I was told, I would not be here, family. You know what I'm saying? So I lift up and I salute my ancestors, right? I salute those personal individuals that took a couple of moments of their time during their life here. In this, in this existence right now that we know that we call life, that we can only see with our limited vision. I lift up my glass and I salute. And we starting off the toast today with Uncle Perry. Uncle Perry Rogers. Rogers. Uncle Perry Rogers, because my brother Kwame has to go and see do an internment tonight. So we want to make sure that our ancestors travel with him. We want to make sure that the spirit guides and touch him and his family and allow the stories to flow and the good times to flow and the joy to flow. And as Kwame say, may a full wind fill his sails so he can move on to the next phase of his existence. 
see as black folks, we go beyond just life. We have existence. We always were, we always will be. As us to prepare a beautiful place for him to spend his time right now and may the family continue to build so that he could come back into a strong lineage. I say from there, we move on to the list. And I have to apologize, family, because there was a mix up. Our list didn't get put into the book. I know, I know some of y'all, I, I know. I'm joyful that we got the book out, right? I'm joyful we got the book out. And I'm joyful that we was that we that we had it get up and, and put the money down so that we could do the damn book. Right? So not even the damn the blessed book. Don't toast our ancestors. Shots going out to Miles Brown, Miss Ann, Robin the Tech Center, Davis, Ron Brown, Sailor. Herman Brown, Senior Rosalie Tilly, George and William Walter, Chris and Fanny Gass, and Aunt Lena, Uncle Chris, I'm Fiend Cleveland, and Geneva Brown, Margaret Ellis, Wash Ellis, Cecil Ellis, Arval Brown, Gina Gaines, Herman Brown II, Barbara Twiggs, Wash Ellis Jr., Katie Ellis, Nikki Ellis, Jamon Jones, Jeremiah Tappet, John Falar, Montague Pittman now. <sighs> Brian Watson Jr. Nico Parsons, Normal X, Malika Fakir, Dr. Marianne Williams, Kojo Kamal, Elder Farmer, Elder Millie Dixon, Tony Clark, Pastor Yusuf Weston, Elder Ajani, Elder Ron Coleman, Elder Robert Donaldson, Alfred Brofro, Hector Jr., Jay Edwards, Carla Harris, Grace Lundy, Inez Harris, William Bill Moss, and Lucy Wright, Derek L. Pulley, and the Luxter brothers, Mrs. Eda Brooks Crawley, Miss Marie Nelson, Mr. Frederick Crawley Sr., Miss Jerry Brunson, Mr. Alonzo Johnson, Miss Marie McDowell, Janice Foster, Charles Jordan, Carol Smith, Walter Smith, Richard Triggs, Francis Johnson, Mary Franklin, Jimmy Williams, Daniel Ford, George Gibson, Nana Loretta Clark, Inez McCray, Fritz Clark. Katie Justice, Derek Randleman, Virginia Rogers, Reverend James, um, Smith, Lois Henderson, Calvin Spratling, Mary Elizabeth Walker, Raymond Walker Sr., Sarah Jane Carter, Michael Ford Jr., Carolyn D. Russell, Susan B. Smith, Teresa Clay, Melvin Dale Hodge, Melvin Dale Hodge Jr., Herman Copeland, Mildred Copeland, Jenny Clay, Burr Beatty, Sarah Ware, LaVita Farmer, Agoso Sue, Sh um, Cheryl Harvey, Aunt Charmaine, Aunt Evelyn, The Oldest Hasbury, Harvey Hasbury Sr., Leonard Dickinson, T.C. Islam, Terrell Dunbar, Will Thomas, Sarah Berry, Mark Walsh, Meryl B. Thornton, Pearl G. Thornton, Ida Johnson, Florence M. Carter, Joanne Thornton, Eric and Tricia Lewis, Juanita Wright, George Wright, Mary, Eliza, Frederick Davis, the Rogers, Mr. Keechler Reese, Linda Watson Hammonds, Jarrell Giles Watson, Sparrow Slimmy, Selvin Lewis, Andrew Holmes, Pearl Moore, Percy Moore Jr., Mildred Owens, Booker T. Bowden, Charlie Hunt, Sammy Stover, Hilda Pearson, Sturgeon Thornton, Richard Thornton, Lavinia Hall, Freeman Bankston, Mary Moss, Willie Thornton, Napoleon Killing Kennedy, Mark Ramsey, Paul Ramsey, Matt Ramsey, David Ramsey, Charles E. Thornton, Frankie Quails, Urania Thornton, Bernice Quails, Ernestine Jackson. Oh my God. Family, I'll stop. Nope. All right. Woo. All right. Let me go on back and get back to the screen. Woo. Richard Thornton, Lavinia Hall, Freeman Bankster, Mary Moss, Ophelia Peacock, Willie Thornton, Napoleon Kennedy. Napoleon Kennedy. Where are we? Let's just start there. Willie Thornton, Napoleon Kennedy, Mark Ramsey, Paul Ramsey, Matt Ramsey, David Ramsey, Charles E. Thornton, Frankie Quails, Urania Johnson, Bernice Quails, Ernestine Jackson, Frank, Frankie Johnson, Teresa Mormon, Leon Johnson, Charles Bell, Vivian Ramsey, Essie Johnson, Delrita Johnson, Leon Johnson. Leon Johnson, James W. West Sr., James Parham, Dana Jones, Henry Worlds, James Farmer, Mary Chavez, Leon, Gray, Leon Gross, Bessie Johnson, Hattie Levester, Mary Moreland, Paul Moreland, Rosemary Martineer, Elder Amotet Wellman, Fred Douglas Triggs Sr., Thelma Triggs, Thomas and Lula Berry, 
T and Eleanor Howe, Frank and Russell and Davis, Fred Douglas, Triggs the second, Vena Triggs, Reverend Eddie Moore, Helen Fuller, Eugene Jackson, Richard Ellis, Silas Alexander, Charles Maxwell, Percy May Alexander, Arthur. Stanley Lockhart, Ricky Lockhart, William Lockhart, Will Joe Lockhart, Brenda Porter, Deacon Hargrove, Andrew Parker, Doris Donald, Ellis Murphy. Okay. I say, all right, family, from there, from there, and we move to the present moment. We are on here for uh kwanzaa on ujima as as our collective responsibility for those who don't speak the net language my principles is uh, righteousness for the m7 which is the millennium seven we teach the kids about respect the color is blue the vibration hermetic the um hermetic law is vibration if you were a male born on this day, cool. If you were a female, it's a cool. Um, if somebody could remind me, right, to talk about the day names, because it's important because I did it on um, YouTube, but it's important that we talk about the day names at least once a year. So unless I get some new information, the power of the day names. Because your ancestors was cold, man. They left you, they left us all types of weapons, family. We got to understand, man, that the warriorship is goes beyond the spears, the swords, the guns. You know what I'm saying? Our ancestors coded us with information, right? They coded us. They coded us so that we could always have something to hang on to. Because during those battles, when you get tired, you need to be like, yo, boom, you need to be able to switch and get out of you and get into the battle. You need to get out of you and get into the moment. You don't get tired. Right? When you and when you when you are able to 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 dissolve your ego into the moment, family, you get into you get into that into that moment thought you get into that you become present and it's a whole different thing if you have ever played sports if you ever done a martial art you ever did where you got into the moment call it going into the zone family we got to understand that our ancestors when we used to go to battle family we were going to a trance when we get went when we went into the rituals, we are going to the trance. When we had a major problem as a community, we were going to a trance, and we would come out with the answer. We would come out with the victory. We would come out with the solution. We would come out with 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 victory. Uh, we allowed the individual ego to dissolve, and with it dissolving in that moment the ancestors and the creative energies to flow through us and the possible. Mm. But a lot of us don't want that no more, right? Because doing the impossible is scary. We want to scare our enemy. Right? We don't want to scare those. But I'm I'm about to break this shit down for y'all family because I the the the, the idea of pops up over and over and over again in this in these fables i'm reading right because i'm i need y'all i need y'all to pick up something as far as self-determination family and especially us as a group i need y'all understand it and i don't think a lot of y'all i don't think a lot of us are getting it so we lift up our glass to this present moment and we move on to the future and we say our shade we move on to the future and we call on our children our children's children on to infinity right now while they are sleeping if some of them might still be up playing with the games that they got or the gifts that they got over this holiday during this holiday season some of them might be up reading some of them might be up writing some of them might be in the belly right now send that energy out 
We call on those future generations. We call them and we wake them up. And I ain't talking about just waking them up physically. We wake them up intuitionally. We wake them up mentally. We wake them up emotionally. We wake them up spiritually. Most importantly, we wake them up physically so that they can carry on the banner. They can lift up the cultural traditions. They can learn our ways and live a culturally appropriate life and live a healthy life. We lift up the glass and we call on them because we are responsible for the legacy that we leave them, family. So we lift up our glass and we say our shape. From there, we move on. Brother Hatem, we go to all of our relations. The two-legged, the four-legged, we salute the wing and we salute those that swim in the ocean. We salute all of the elements. We salute all the directions. We salute all of the beings that are around us that we can see that we can't see. Life energy itself. And we say it and we salute it all the time. But a lot of times we only recognize this what we're doing when we say our shame. So we lift up our glass and we say, me and family, we move on to you. I toast you for getting up in the morning. I toast you for celebrating and coming to Kwanzaa with us. I toast you, family. Salute you. And I ask that our ancestors move with you, especially if you could getting up in there and doing the work. Because family, whether y'all know it or not, this is work. You know what I'm saying? This is the work. This is the ultimate work. Why? Because we're calling on something bigger, on, bigger than ourselves, preparing for what's coming. See it, right? Sometimes I wonder if we even see it. And I ain't talking to my regulars because I know you know, but the ones on our timelines, they be filling our timelines with foolishness. They don't know. I, I think I think the word is a critical mass. It only take a critical mass of us because when a group of us start moving, and the energy. They can't help but to join, family. They can't help but to join. Even when they send agents to try to break us up. When we start calling those ancestors, the ancestors are going to start turning their hearts. And if not turning their hearts, going to turn their souls and stop their hearts. So we lift up our glass to you, family. To you. Because our wealth is not just in the material thing. You know what I'm saying? Our wealth is in the people. Our wealth is in the people and the skills that we bring to the table and the love that we bring to the table and the sharing and the gifts that we bring to the table. And speaking of the table, family, we lift up our glass and we say, I say, I say, I say, I say, I say, I say. We lift up our glass, family. We toast, right? We say, I will in 100 years. Hot damn. Hot damn. All right. So, Kwame, it looks like it's just me and you, bro. I is out there. Throw up your thumbs. Let me know you out there. Now, the, the discussion was about the lion. The story called The Lion. So one of the things that keep popping up, one of the things, how is my battery low? What in the hell? What type of witchcraft is this? What? Uh-uh. 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 Uh, what, what in the hell? What? Get out of here. But witchcraft is this, right? All right, family, here we go, here we go, here we go. One of the things that I notice a lot of times is that in these folk tales, they often end with death. I'm gonna have to put a call, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to put a call in. You know what I'm saying? But family, I want y'all to think about this. There's a lot of deal with death, right? And a lot of us don't really realize that when people are dealing with legislation, 
right? When they're dealing with some of the issues that they're dealing with on our community, and they do shit like say, hey, Jerusalem is the capital of Israel, right? They're turning their back on our issues. And when they turn their back on our issues, people die, right? You know what I'm saying? People, decisions, people's decisions affect us. And in many cases, it causes members of our group to die. We're not operating with self-determination, whether we're talking about self-determination in politics, self-determination in economics, self-determination in, 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 in education, turn over our self-determination, self-determination and trust others. That's some good, man, this Ambrosia is good. Because we do that, right? We expose ourselves and we expose our children to danger, danger. We got to stop that, right? I got to disappear, family, because my phone is about to die. Understand what? Well, I do understand. You know what I'm saying? We know that there's some wickedness afoot, and I'm not mad. That means I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing, family. So, hey, understand that it's our self determination that protects us, family. It's our ability to stand up for ourselves, it's our ability to find reality for ourselves. For so long, we have been allowing other people to define what it is and who it, who we are. Yeah. When we do that, we put our lives at risk. As we put our future generations, not just the children that we can see, we put the children that we can't see fate in the hands of other people. That's not self-determination. Mm -hmm. how we get down we have never got down like that now and we have to understand family that it's up to us if we're gonna turn this corner we got to start making a turn now using and harnessing our self-determination another aspect of self-determination um is when you look at the principle, the modern principle that go along with it, justice, right? Out of my eye, justice. Are we, are we, see, because we constantly worry about justice and people being trusted, I mean, and treated justly, but I got a question for you. Just for us to look for justice for others before we look for justice for ourselves. That's self-determination. You can't receive justice. You don't receive justice if you are not self-determined to get it. Justice is not something that is not something that the universe is going to hand to us. Because um, um, Martin Luther King said the arc of justice is long. The reason it's long is because people are not activated. They are not activated and they are not seeking out. They are not hunting down justice, family. We're turning over. We're turning over our well-being to people who don't have our best interests at heart. Even in our own community, there's a lot of times the leaders are more concerned about themselves than they are about the people that's following them. We act like we have changed our whole uh, paradigm of wealth. And your paradigm. The wealth is not in the money. The wealth is in the people. How many people can we get to build? How many people can we get? And when I say build, I'm not just talking about sitting around talking. I'm talking about how much can we can pull together with skills to actually just like if we say, all right, boom, we're going to buy a plot of land. Can we build us a building where only in, in, in that building, in that building only, will we be able to do our events? The speakers that we want. Will we be able to erect the monuments that we want for our movement to Right, but I ain't gonna belabor the point because my phone is about to die, and obviously some of y'all still sleep. Tonight at Kwanzaa at 6 p.m. drum call. Don't be late. I'm expecting to see you, family. And I need to let you know you are now listening to Giami Journey Radio. This is Giami Journey. Actually. This is a hard December production, and of course, this has been the Daily Toast.
time. Your host, Brother Hot Tim. Of course, you know I always strive to blow up your old paradigm. So let me get some rest before my babies get up. I'm out. Peace. Phone ain't charging. My tablet ain't charging. Going on. But whatever it is, is. Whatever it is, it's cool.